What inspires me, I think, is being able to be at the center of a group of people and really bring together the best of what everybody has to offer. To take a play that was written in 1602 for the English court and to set that on a, t on a TV soundstage, essentially, in 1969, and then to produce that on a liberal arts college campus in 2021 takes a lot of work, takes a lot of imagination. I've always had this overwhelming need to be able to tell stories, even if they're not necessarily my own. I just have always known that whether it's music or theater, some sort of live performance, being in the room with an audience, getting them to react in some way is important to me. And acting does fulfill that requirement, but there's an intellectual life in the theater um, beyond that, that directing and design has provided for me. Um, and as a director, I get to put my hands on the entire text. And instead of feeling the way the actors might feel on stage and performing the thing, I get to be that audience. I get to be the audience for the entire rehearsal period. I get to see the thing over and over and over again and craft it such that an audience is going to react to it the way that I want them to and to get out of the play, out of this old, old play with a lot of stories to tell, the stories that I'd like them to see. Not only is it really funny, the message it's sending is one of like living so freely and that runs through every scene of the play and everyone is really able to lean into that spirit and move loosely and actually turn play from instead of just being a noun, a thing that we're going to see, that leaning into the verb and playing on stage. So it is joyful and it's fun to watch.